I'm Shannon Haymauer. I'm Brooks Haymauer. So by trade, I'm actually a technical editor. I uh, did editing for 10 years, and um, during that time, uh, it was 2013, uh, Brooks bought me a quote-unquote nice camera because I wanted to take pictures of our boys. And I had the camera for about two weeks, and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna learn how to shoot manual. So I challenged myself, and our boys at the time were toddlers, they wouldn't sit still. So I contacted my friend, I said, you know, hey, your friend, your, you know, your, your kids will sit still. Can I take pictures of them? She said, yeah, so I came on over, had a good time. I thought, you know what, for the rest of 2013, I'm going to challenge myself to learn how to shoot manual and try different genres. So that's what I did. So one month I did family, one month I did um, a couple session and was just having a good time with that. And then in January 2014, I thought, well, the only thing I haven't tried that I want to is boudoir. So I contacted a friend, she came over to our house. It was a dreary January day. I had my little camera, a reflector, and I had an absolute wonderful time. I fell in love with boudoir. I started out as a home brewer. I uh, just needed something to do after football season when I get a little bit miserable that my team lost in the playoffs and then win the Super Bowl. Um, it just really kind of grew uh, you know, into a passion obsession that uh, I always constantly wanted to make my beer better. And uh, we started uh, going to local homebrew festivals where you know I could pour our beer for people at the festival and one thing I always kept coming up one question where can I buy this where can I buy this where can I buy this so you know figured uh, you know we might have a uh, have a product here that we could uh, you know actually sell to someone so looked into things perfect opportunity came together and we were in Mexico for our long over to honeymoon and I pitched her the idea and you know she she said to Emphatically, yes, let's do this. Um, you know, you've supported us through, you know, you supported me through everything with going pro of the uh, photography business. How can I ever say no to you when it comes to your dream? So let's, let's do it. So we started talking last year, 2021, and about, you know, why are we not combining our businesses? Uh, we know sex sells, but we want to do something classy. Uh, something sensual, something that's going to make you stop as you're scrolling. Um, and we thought, well, let's let's take my photography, my style, my vision, and we put these women with our beer. And each month we have a different theme, and it's it's been really good. We do work well together per se. Um, there are times where you know there's frustrations between the two of us, you know. But uh, you know, we always have that one common goal, um, you know, and you know, bringing my you know following from the brewing side as well as her following together to build uh, you know a bigger brand together. And our you know overall dream of both businesses to be under one building and to name it Beer Boudoir. Um, that way, uh, we can you know support each other in our businesses and be very close. Each month has a theme. So one month we, um, with the Lucky Lobster, um, the girls were wearing uh, like leather or pleather. We did more of a rock star vibe and uh, we got pictures of the girls with the cans, drinking it. Um, today's session is we're highlighting um, the Hellas. Um, the theme is winter white. The girls are wearing white. Um, so that's pretty much how we, we highlight. We think, you know, what do we want to highlight? Go with it, run with it, pick a lingerie theme that will complement. I was a little apprehensive at first to put the, uh, the photography on the wall. Being as the nature that it is, you never know who's gonna come, come by and get offended, and then I'm gonna have to deal with that. But honestly, everyone has enjoyed it thoroughly. There has been so many selfies taken with the rear end picture um, which is always uh, you know fun fun to see on social media when someone's tagging us uh, with that picture in the background or you know taking a selfie with it um, so it, it's very class classically done it's very tasteful it's not raunchy at all so at the end of the day you know it's a decision we made and we're gonna we're gonna deal with any uh, ramifications that come from it at that point in time but it's been overwhelming everyone's been supporting and loved it loves it I actually think it's very 
they, it ties well together because my ideal client is an everyday woman, right? That's all shapes, all sizes, ages, beliefs. Well, the, our beer drinkers are everyday people, all shapes, all sizes, all ages, beliefs. So it makes sense to, you know, introduce the beer drinkers to boudoir because a lot of the ladies they do want to have own beautiful photos of themselves and then vice versa a lot of our my clients they love uh, craft beer one thing going into this project I, I dedicated myself into just trying to have the most diverse offerings that we can you know I've been to places before where it's half hazy IPAs and the other half stouts well, there, there's so many wonderful styles out there of beer and to you know put your eggs all into one basket or two baskets seems a little bit off-putting to me. So uh, as well as um, from the tech, technological side of it, I want to, to push myself, my capabilities. So I want to brew styles that aren't comfortable, that some brewers may be like, well, you know, let's, we'll, we'll do it at a later point. No, I, I want to go challenge myself with those challenges, make my you know, make myself a better brewer, as well as a better, better business owner uh, for it. So, you know, we usually uh, you always have our our flagships, the Hellas, Lucky Lobster, Oats and Hose, Americanization, but you know we'll throw in you know barrel aged series beer or you know saisons, sours, you know, uh, very very diverse portfolio uh, for it, which many many people come in here and for the first time they look at the beer list and you know wow. Wow, I can't believe you have so many styles um, that you know they're expecting a certain thing from us, and we just completely blow them away. An actual boudoir session is done at my studio in downtown Carlisle, and what happens is once a client books me, we're going to figure out what are their outfits. They'll know what they're going to wear before they even step foot into the studio, and that in itself often relieves any anxiety that they might be having because um, you know it's it's a big step it's it's an intimate step what are you going to wear you know that that can be nerve-wracking for a lot of women so we're gonna figure that out what are you going to wear um, and then during the session hair and makeups included I pose them top to bottom start to finish um, so they don't come in trying to figure out what do they do with their their hands do they smile do they even look at the camera I'm gonna direct them um, they absolutely have input on, you know, the setup. Do we want to do, you know, light and airy, dark and moody, um, a shower scene? Um, it's a really, it's a collaboration between the two of us. So I often tell women, because they'll contact me and they'll say, oh, my husband's birthday's coming up, our anniversary's coming up. And I tell them, well, honestly, the truth is you want to do the session. You just think you have to have an excuse, right? Because if a woman did not want to do a boudoir session, she would not do a boudoir session. So a woman will do it because she needs that boost of confidence. She, you know, she wants to reconnect with herself. Um, most of my clients are in the 30s, 40s, 50s. They're well established in the career. A lot of them are moms. They've been married for a bit, and they just want to, you know, reconnect and feel like themselves. They want a day of pampering. They want a day of not having to worry about laundry and <laughs> feeding somebody and 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 all of that. So, but they do it because they they want a confidence. Booster. So I would tell them because a lot of times I'll hear that they're not confident and I'll say you know at least be confident in me that I'm going to capture you the way that you're envisioning even better than you're envisioning that you're going to have fun that your hair and makeup's going to look good you know what you're going to wear will look great on you. you have confidence in that that I know what I'm doing you know because I know if I can get them into the studio they're going to relax they're going to have a good time. Our long-term goal is again to have a, a, both businesses under one building. So the studio is on one side of the building, the uh, tap room's on the other. With you know the the brewery itself, everything's incorporated, and you know we're there on the same premise. You know clients can come in and have a session, and then at their image reveal, have a beer after, and and vice versa, have a beer, and then like ah, oh, you know, I'm going to book a session. So. Yeah, just have everything uh, under, I'll call it one campus, you know, that everything is incorporated with it. Um, that way, you know, she can have everything she needs um, for her reveals, her photo shoots, but yet to have all the brewing operations, have the business offices, 
you know, tap room, full kitchen, all that. So, you know, I'm working away as we speak now on another location, whether it be a, our permit location for the future or just another offset. You mainly just come, come in and relax. I often say, you know, check the world at the door because we don't need all the stress and chaos that the world brings to everyone uh, in here. Come in, relax, enjoy yourself, enjoy your company, and uh, enjoy the products that we provide for you, whether it be you know, you know, our beer, our, our food that we provide for you, and enjoy your time. The easiest way is to go to my website, paboudoir.com. They can fill out a form to get info sent to them. It will give you an overview of the sessions, gives you the price list. Um, there's no surprises, it's right there. They like what they read, they can schedule a phone consult, and at that time, you know, we'll talk about their vision, how do they want to be photographed, and we can get them on the books and you know, get a session going. So my motivation was um, my kids moved out, empty nester, um, something to do for me, make me feel good. So it was an amazing experience. Her attention to detail, she walks you right through it from the time you call her until you get to your session. She has you relaxed within a couple minutes. Um, you walk out of there feeling empowered, confident. The feeling that when you walk away, how good you look, how she makes you look. Um, hair and makeup is phenomenal. The out she walks you through the outfits, the choice for your body type, um, just the end result. It's just, and then the re reveal for pictures is just amazing. During the session itself, having the picture, the, seeing the pictures at the end, I think was a lot of fun. But the whole experience, from the time you walk in the door with her to you leave, is a lot of fun. <laughs>